Hello everyone, you are tuned in to the Anything Bucket on WRPBI-TV. Tonight in our studio we have an entrepreneur and a philanthropist with a phenomenal product, her Sprouts products, which will help you to sprout up your life. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Sharon Quircioli to the Anything Bucket. Sharon, welcome. Thank you very much for having me. You're welcome. And I'm very excited that you're here because you have this awesome product. I was very impressed. I you know, found you through Facebook. We've been Facebook friends yes. for a while. I decided to go on the website. I saw what you were doing with the whole concept of recycling, but in a very unique way. And it all starts with Sharon's business card. When Sharon hands you a business card, she's actually giving you a gift. Sharon, if you can tell us a little bit about Sprouts and a little bit about the gift that comes with your business card. Yeah. When I hand my business card out, I always tell people, if you notice that it's a little bit larger than a business card, and I tell people you can cut off the bottom of it and you can plant it, and as you watch your flowers grow, you'll never forget who we are. And people go, oh my God, that's the coolest thing ever. And the whole thing is made out of seed paper. So all of our products are made out of it's seed paper, recycled paper that, that has wildflowers embedded in it. So when you send a card or a bookmark or a coaster to someone, instead of them throwing it away, they cut it up and plant it, and it grows flowers, and they never forget who they get it, who they get it from. And I know that uh, talking about planting the seeds, that you do a lot of planting seeds of kindness, talking to uh, students. Uh, I know Sprouts is very involved in the community with a, a variety of charities. If you could tell us a little bit about uh, that and how you plant those seeds of kindness and help people through the Sprouts product. Yeah, we actually work with probably 50 different charities. Uh, one being, um, Jonathan, we have one over here, which is the Center for Great Apes. And what we do is a fundraising program. Um, we have six different cards in there, and we actually create the cards from the photos of the different chimpanzees and the, uh, the, um, um, the Center for Great Apes. And, and then what we do is we sell it to them at a discounted price, so they make $4 per package. Now we do that with the Center for Great Apes, with Hospice of Palm Beach County, we do it with um, Seagull Industries for the Handicap, Loggerhead Marine Life Center for the Turtles. Uh, one of the biggest things that we've done for the last 10 years is for Artie Gras and Art Fest. What we do is we take the, chin the winning children's artwork that the schools provide and we create cards for them. So it's the children's artwork, so on the back of the card it has the child's name, what school, and what grade they're in. And we create a program where we select six cards, we make it a package, and then at Artie Gras and Art Fest, we sell the package of cards, and they make $4 per package, and it goes to the Art Education Fund for the Palm Beach County Schools. We've also done programs for Office Depot Foundation and many other charities. And I know that a lot of businesses are now coming to you because of the uniqueness of your product. I know one of the companies that came to you was actually using your product in their ad campaign with Newsweek magazine. Right. We did, it was actually one of our largest projects. And um, it was Haagen-Dazs, Haagen dazs advertising agency. And um, they had a campaign for a colony collapse disorder and for anyone that's not familiar with that, it's the bees are dying off in droves and it affects everything that we eat. So, and they're not exactly sure how, um, how the bees are being, they're talking about maybe it's, you know, cell phone, maybe it's all different, all different types of spray or whatever. So what we did was we did a piece for haagen for colony collapse disorder that went in Newsweek magazine. And the piece looked like this which is a black-eyed Susan. I worked with the University of California, Berkeley, to come up with a seed mixture that when planted, grows flowers that attract the honeybee to help sustain them. And this was the piece that we came up with. And it says, it says plant this page, save a bee. Mm -hmm. So these are some of the things that, you know, and some of the custom things that we do um, with Sprouts and with different companies that are looking at doing green projects or pieces like this that helps with saving the bees. And I know you can do anything on the seed paper. One of the things that uh, 
really intrigued me was the message of the, uh, the day uh, cards. If you could tell the viewers a little bit about how those uh, came out, and I know you also have the Planting the Seeds of Kindness cards too. Right. Um, we actually, someone came to us and said, you know, I have all these little parties and I'd like to have a little gift. So I want a basket and I'd like you to put like a message of the day. So we created 31 inspirational messages of the day. And so when someone, someone comes into their house, they pick it up, they get the message of the day. It has the planting instructions right on the back of it. But the other interesting thing is from that, we came up with kindness messages. And what we do is we work with children to teach them when someone does something nice for you, give them a kindness message and it has a message on it and tell them thank you so much for being kind and this is a gift where you can plant it and it grows flowers and you'll never forget it, who it came from. But the interesting thing that happened with this is when we were at Artie Gras, a woman came up to us that was um, doing a program for Sandy Hook and, and, the, and it was gonna be their one year memorial. And she said, I love this product. And, she's, and, I, and she said, we're doing a memorial. It's gonna be a huge memorial for you know, the Sandy Hook tragedy. And I said to her, anything that you want, I will give you. So I donated you know, several kindness messages and butterflies, because their, uh, their whole theme was kindness and butterflies. And um, they had a whole big thing for sprouts so that the kids could actually plant their kindness messages. And it really, really went over, way, over well. And these are some of the things that, you know, I mean, in, in this business, you know, I, I've been blessed with opportunities to work with some of the charities and some things that happens to be an unfortunate one that, you know, but um, we made them happy. Well, it's, it's taking the, the tragic situations and making them triumphant and having things that, that live on as a legacy with, with the cards. I know there's one product on the table that one of your clients is doing natural sunglasses and they decided to have you do their packaging. Right. So the innovativeness that you have is incredible and the sky is the limit and it's paying it forward. Tell us a little bit about how you had the inspiration to start Sprouts what the story behind Sprouts is. Okay, well, um, Sprouts it was 10 years old in February, and um, I've been in the recycling business for several years. We used to recycle um, inkjet, inkjet cartridges, cell phones, and, and laser printer toner cartridges. And there was really two reasons that um, I wanted to be able to give back to the community. And by collecting empty inkjet cartridges and cell phones and that, we were able to donate to the charities of choice, which in a lot of cases for me was ch children's charities. And um, from that, um, I had a business card made that was made out of flower petals. And everybody used to comment on my business card all the time. And I thought, geez, I wonder if I could put you know, flower seeds in this and make it grow. And that's kind of how I started the company, and you know it's grown from there, and um, and we've come, come up with, you know, in ten years we've grown and we've created so many different products from, you know, key cards for hotels and you know little wish sprouters for kids that you know they could write their wish, their hope, their fear, their dream, and plant it so it grows into something beautiful. Fantastic! If you could uh, tell the audience where they can connect with you and where they can uh, create their own sprouts in their life. Um, our website is www.sproutem, S-P-R-O-U-T-E-M.com, or our phone number is, our phone number is 561-840-8089. And we want to thank Sharon from Sprouts for being here. Remember to visit www.sproutem.com and put a little sprout in your life while you stay positive.